Look who it is. The stranger that came out of nowhere and now has everyone talking. Some people want you to be a savior, a shining beacon of hope. Those people clearly haven't met you yet. She don't know how to skip rocks her own self. Huh. All right, let's see if we can get around let's this conflict. Oh, crap. Hello. You're not what I want at all. Jeez Louise. And ray damage, huh? So is it dead? Oh crap. Nah. -ha. Well, affected by a status effect, you'll see an icon in the upper left of your HUD. Hey, you can go look at your character sheet to get it. Ah, uh, to get an actual description. Dissident Hunter. When indentured servants are freed, anarchy soon follows. She is. Okay. I used to skip rocks in the river until Constable Reyes ticketed me for unlicensed hair reforming. I think she was jealous. She don't know how to skip rocks her own self. So they, the behemoths, were in that valley. It's it's in one of the buildings. Crap. Well, we'll try to sneak. That's the community set. Oh, I could have gone last time. Marauder Goon, Marauder Vandal. If I can just get in there without causing a firefight. We have four Tangas. That weird ghosting is an odd effect for draw distance. Come on. Yeah, 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 inside. <laughs> That's stupid. Tank, 
corporations joined together and formed the Halcyon Holdings Corporation to buy the rights to the Halcyon system. They sent out their first colony, whatever. <clears throat> oh, it's a raider party in here. Beautiful. Ah, crap. I forget, do they have stealth attacks in this game? Let's find out. No one's shot yet. That's the wrong person. And the firefight begins. And she's down. Crap. I gotta swap in a shotgun. I forget, I think. I forget which kind of ammo they take. Light? Well. How is this freaking possible? Oh, I vey. Well, at least I know where I'm going. But it looks like we're gonna have to. We're gonna have to load up. Oh good, we're out in the wilderness now. Three hundred and eight, we're doing this. Time for my cowboy gun. Where'd he go? Wow. Try going around the back and seeing if that helps. Shut. It's a burst shot. This is inefficient. Actually, no. We're keeping that. We're probably going to give her a stun baton.
Now look at that. That means we only have a hundred shots of the energy rounds. You know, if they keep showing me those, it's gonna make me think that yeah, you know, that that that's what I'm gonna be facing soon. You know. Oh, okay, that was weird. Buy all the heavy ammo possible. All the junk gets sold. Mr. Ouch increases. Oh, it's a melee upgrade. That doesn't change anything for me. Elite troop armor. 17. Wow. It's heavy, though. It's heavy. Ordnance control armor. Aren't I at 12? It's Spacer's Choice! Yeah. I'm at six. Repair. Oh, nine is all it got me to. Well then. Nine, nine. Tech skills plus five. Hack plus seven. This is actually better. And I look super cool. Wow, I look I look like a dude from Destiny. That's hilarious. I kind of wish I had the modular armor system from Fallout 4. But, you know, you can't have everything. Because if you could have everything, why would you uh, play another game, right? <laughs> mm. Now, if I can get there without triggering anything. That would be awesome. Let's take a look. Nobody in there. Of course it is. Stupid. Thank you for saving me, though. Everyone, all right? If the oceans and rivers are the heart of the veins of Emerald Veil and Saltuna are the highly profitable blood. These meaty fish live in the ocean and migrate upstream during mating season. Saltuna are some uh, some will perish, which means they perish after a single reproductive ep episode. That's why that's when our trusty Spacer's Choice harvesters scoop up their corpses to be cleaned, processed, canned, and delivered straight to your dinner table. No wonder people are getting sick.
And there's those things. You wait for them to die? I mean, usually they die from exhaustion, but still. You're harvesting dead animals for your canned goods. Just fish them with a net like everybody else or farm them. It's a scrap. Now, where's that stupid book? Crap. Well, at least I have her this time. This better be worth it. You're fast. First day room key. Ordnance control armor. Whoa, that's pretty worth it. I can go in here now. Useful. Who ate my lunch? Yeah, now we're just taking everything. You know, I was worried about how low the inventory is, but since they split everything up into its category and you can only have X amount of that category, it's way easier. It's way better. We're not going in there yet. We're going to try to pick up a book without having any issues. <clears throat> Oh, he did not like that. Best part is we can kill everyone in here and then just walk out the back door. Be totally fine. Oh, nobody in here. I'll take that. You know what? I don't see anything I really care about in there. Ah, oh, there are two little boxes. They're not going to have anything earth shattering in them. Let's just leave. Bread noodles. Money. Ring. But not in supernova difficulty, huh? Wow. Raising your melee weapon skills unlock the ability to do power and sweep attacks. In supernova difficulty, I bet you, most people just go by themselves, leave their companions at home. Alright, 
Now I just gotta get out of the town without triggering people. Which should be fine. Nice and easy. See, but the ground is growing stuff. There's grass and things. So I don't quite understand their issue. Hey, buddy. Any luck finding one of those manuals? Actually, I found two. Today's your lucky day. I've got one of those data pads you no wanted. No kidding. Really? Well, which one? One and two. Look at that. Building a computing machine out of Spectrum potatoes, a primer. I'm just glad it survived all these years. Two whole data pads? Be still my beating heart. Oh, almost forgot your payment. Hold on, I got one more Don't for you. Me in suspense. Part two. Ain't that just ironical? If I'd worked a little longer back at the cannery, I might have found this myself. That's a complete set. All three parts. I'm gonna be the greatest engineer Halcyon's ever seen. Um, aside from you, Miss Parvati, I swear. I'll do you proud. Hmm. I'm glad we could help, Thomas. I've been saving something for you. Uh, just a little contraption I found. Should fit right into your outfit. Really? Electro Electrocharge surface. I should go. You know what? I'm gonna see if I can talk to him. Sorry. Uh, I'm just trying to figure out what to do is all. I wanna ask you something. What's on your mind? Oh, no. It's like, do you like Parvati? Mm, do you? He's leaving town. That, the snakes come back. I never thought I'd see the day that Reed Thompson abandoned his post. Suppose we all have a breaking point. Well. Suppose it's time our flock made our way back to Edgewater. We must tend to what remains of the town and carry on with our lives as best we may. You're vexing to me, you know? Injuring us with one hand, helping us with the other. Here, I'm giving you something to leave us be. It's a ransom, you understand, not a reward. Hmm. I did not make a mess of things. I fixed everything. Edgewater's better off with you running the place. You're telling me you did all this just to put me in charge of Edgewater. Stranger, you are some kind of twisted. No, I just did it to the best. Okay. I, I just did what was best. Got ourselves a whole cemetery bursting with bodies. I need some time to gather my personals. Long walk back to Edgewater. Got a considerable burden to carry. Okay. Hi, you're really close. That was a good thing we did, Captain. Helping to bring the deserters and Edgewater folks back together. I hope you rest well on that. I will. So I'm putting one in stealth. Wait a minute. Yeah, for lockpick. Because I need lockpick 20. Hmm. 33. Almost got a tinkering thing. Engineering. Leadership I don't really care about. Well, do I get one that raises their health? No. kind of like that the inhaler heals me and my companions. That's kind of cool.
And we're nearly at heavy weapons to better crits. Ninety-seven percent handgun crit chance. That's amazing. Hundred and eighteen percent long gun crit chance. Uh, we're gonna put some, and we're gonna get forty right there. Beautiful. Then. Hmm. I don't really care though. I'm not anywhere near anywhere useful. Guess we're shoving it in tech. Yerp. Five. I get five of these perks. So three more. Companion crit chance goes up. That's nice. Sprint speed. More. Uh. More ammo, basic armor rating goes up five. Uh, recharge rate is up fifty percent. Walk speed is faster. I think I'm gonna go with toughness, deadly demonstrations, and strider. for my plaques and stuff. Level six. Nice. Now I can go back to my ship. There it is. Mm -hmm. Damage type, swing speed, and more improvements are available. is just so handsome. Does she have a name yet? What's uh -huh. a drive mom? Oh, gosh. <laughs> Listen to me babbling. When I was in Edgewater, I dreamed of flying on a real ship, working on a real engine, belonging to a proper crew. I'm the only decent mechanic Edgewater's got, but every time I think of going back, I get this sinking feeling. I can understand not wanting to go back. Wanting to go back? You didn't seem happy in Edgewater. You to say that. And you're right. I wasn't happy. I want to ask you something, and you can say no. But can I come with you? I could tend to your engine. I know my G valves for my catalyzers, and I can keep your ship singing. Sounds good to me. If you ever need a pair of eyes watching your back, I can do that too. What do you think? You just met me. Why would you want to go into space with a stranger? Yeah, I've been thinking about that. Edgewater was on the verge of collapse before you showed up. You sent them power, and now the town might see another season. And you talked Miss McDevitt into coming back to town. 
Maybe one day, Edgewater will have a garden where that cannery once stood. You ain't exactly a stranger anymore. You've done some kindness hereabouts. I wouldn't mind following somebody like that. I'd be glad to have you along, Kaylee. Pick a cabin, it's yours. Yes. I mean, thanks. You won't regret this, mister. K Kaylee from Firefly, by the way. I can call you captain now. Ha! <laughs> I got a captain. Because he's just Kaylee. 